Hey guys, and welcome back to Game Blitz. Uh, in this video, what I'm going to be going over is how to solve the system trust untrusted system file from the Easy Anti Cheat pop up. So, when you're playing a game, specifically Watch Dogs 2 or any other game you're having that does this, what you're going to want to do so when like when the game crashes and it says um you know system untrusted system file easy and I cheat so to fix it what you're gonna wanna do is open up your uplay launcher and go ahead and locate the game that's giving you the error which for me it was Watch Dogs 2 you go ahead and click onto it and you go to properties and if you see down here at the bottom it says game launch arguments now how you're going to want to fix this is just type in negative EAC underscore launcher in the command line and that will disable the easy anti cheat from blocking this untrusted file or whatever it's doing to cause this crash. So go ahead and enter that in there and launch the game. And I'll show you guys real quick that this actually does not let you play multiplayer. So if you disable the easy anti cheat it will disable your multiplayer um, and you won't be able to connect to the game or any servers or anything like that if you disable that easy internet cheat and I'll show you the message when you go to the menu so as you can see it says error easy internet cheat is not installed multiplayer will be disabled so that's the first method guys if that works for you and you don't mind disabling your multiplayer go ahead and uh, just quit with that if um, you're looking for a way to keep your multiplayer enabled and not have to disable a multiplayer and stuff like that you can potentially fix it by going to the command prompt and running that as the administrator so what I'm going to show you is way to check the system corruption maybe this will locate and fix the file that's giving you the untrusted system error from the AC so go ahead and type in ssc space forward slash scan now and hit enter and what that will do is it will check your system for corrupted files or anything out of the ordinary that might be causing the AZ anti cheat to trigger and it would automatically fix it itself so go ahead once it's finished doing that go ahead and open your game and see if it worked but if it didn't work guys make sure you go ahead and just um, disable the EAC because I don't believe there's any other fix for it at the moment at least none that I know of so if this helped you guys go ahead leave a like share and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one